Hey, how's it going, my friend? My name is James Randhouse, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about on learning to love what you want and the habits that lead to what you want. Now, this is part. Now, this is the final video in my video series on the simple science of invincibility. So, I'm really excited to bring this information to you today. And to really just wrap up the series and leave on as high a note as possible. So, if you haven't already, take out a pen and a piece of paper and get ready to jot down some notes because we're going to talk about some powerful stuff. Now here's the thing. Now you can take joy or pleasure in anything if you set your mind to it. So my question is, why not train yourself to love the things that strengthen you? Now it's very easy to love things that don't strengthen us. I say stuff like candy or sitting down and watching TV or just doing things like that. You know what I mean? It's like when well, you're not really like doing anything productive per se, but it just it kind of just feels good like when you're in the moment of doing it. So my challenge for you is like, why not go and train your mind to do things that will make you better? Why not train yourself to like love discipline or train yourself to love eating healthy food or train yourself to love reading or train yourself to love the things that's going to make you a better person? It's way too easy to just fall into the traps that are set up by society. Traps like reading about celebrity gossip and like worrying about what other people are doing. Like you can, you can very easily just shift your mindset by just focusing on the things that's going to empower you and you can literally program yourself in such a way where like you become attracted to those things. So I know it sounds kind of crazy, but it actually is quite possible if you just put your mind to it. Now here's the thing. We tend to do the things that we want to do. And if we fall in love with the things we desire intensely and completely, we are more likely to attain them. Now you see, like as human beings, we're not just rational creatures, but we're also highly emotional creatures. And I say that because we yes, we are very good at like um making rational decisions, at least when we want to be and stuff, but emotions still play a very vital role in how we go about moving in the world and stuff. So Whoops, I got ahead of myself there. So if it's if you can just take those emotions, those powerful emotions like love and affection and desire, things like that, and just channel it into the things that you want, you're going to just naturally want to do them. You're going to naturally just gravitate towards those things, and it's going to make achieving your results that much easier. Now, here's the thing. Now, we all know that in order to get what we want, we're going to have to do distasteful, distasteful things to acquire that which we desire. For example, say you want to have like a beautiful body. You want to be in like the best shape of your life. Maybe you've been in bad shape all your life or you've just been in average shape, but you decided like out of nowhere, you really want to step things up. So here's the thing, right? Like a lot of us don't really like exercise, right? Because it requires a lot of like physical exertion and you'll be sore the next day. It's like, it's, it's a time commitment. It's, it's like there's a lot that goes into working out. But if you train yourself to love the act of exercising as intensely as you train yourself to as to love, like, say, eating like junk food or just being inactive in general, you're able to transform your life in such a way where like later on down the line, you're able to get that body that you want. You're able to be in the best shape of your life because you train yourself to love the things that are going to get you in the best shape of your life. Now, our behaviors tend to move in the directions of our desires. The more intensely you can train yourself to desire the things you want and the behaviors that will at that will attain them, the more quickly they will be yours. It's very simple if you think about it, because imagine how hard it would be to like have something that you want. Say you have a goal that you really, really want to achieve, but you hate everything that's involved as far as getting that goal. Now you're making things 10 times if not even a hundred times harder on yourself like granted even if it's a good goal even if like it makes sense for why you want to attain it and you're able to list out your reasons if you can't bring yourself to enjoy the things that's going to get you to achieve the things that you want how are you possibly going to do it it's going to be a struggle the entire way you're going to be kicking and screaming it's just going to be very very difficult so instead take the path of least resistance if you're already feel inclined to like the things that you need to do anyways then it's just going to be a lot easier to do them very simple stuff so with that being said we just went over a lot of information within this video series so i want to ask you a question do you want a daily ritual for increasing your product for increasing your invincibility and productivity that's simple to follow 
Does that sound like something that would be pretty appealing to you? Well, then you need to go to jamesrenhouse.com forward slash symbology and start your 30 day free trial. Now, this is a program that I've been using personally for quite some time now, and I can tell you with the utmost certainty that it has absolutely rocked my world if you decide to really like put time and en energy and effort into learning the simpleology system and it's a free trial so you can't even go wrong with that you're going to see how invincible how much more productive you become that's using a simple to follow system and it's just it's just absolutely incredible so i want to end the series on this though because i felt like i've been giving you guys a lot of value but i think i could give you even more value and what better way to give you even more value you that give you a tool that can help automate becoming more invincible and more productive because i think a lot of people could really benefit from that so that being said guys this is james rentenhouse from james rentenhouse.com hope you guys got a lot of video got a lot of value out of this video as well as from this video series on the simple science of invincibility make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and i will see you on the next video bye for now